Is it time to buy or sell Meta stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Meta. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, 28th May, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since May 24, 2024, our system has ranked Meta as a hold accumulate, giving it a score of negative 0.25. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock has experienced natural fluctuations with a gain of 0.36%. This translates to an average return of 0.18% per day since it was listed as hold accumulate. The stock has broken the wide and falling short-term trend up. Firstly, a slower falling rate is indicated, but this may very well be an early signal of a trend shift. On the reaction, there will be support on the roof of the current trend broken, which is $475.66, a level that may pose a second chance to hit a runner. According to fan theory, $535.11 will be the next possible trend top level, and thereby pose a resistance level that may not be broken at the first attempt. The current three-month trend suggests a potential negative 8.61% change over the next three months, with a possible return between negative 20.74% and negative 9.42%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests an 84.71% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 69.19% and 117.32%. This translates to a price range of $811.96 to $1,042.95 after a year. Our latest daily update for Meta includes the headline, Meta Stock Downgraded to Hold Accumulate. The Meta stock price gained 0.355% on the last trading day, Tuesday, 28th May 2024, rising from $478.22 to $479.92. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 1.27% from a day low at $474.84 to a day high of $480.86. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a 2.54% gain for the last two weeks. Volume fell on the last day by negative 2 million shares, and in total, 10 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $4,700,000,000. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $531.49, and the lowest price was $258.45. Currently, the price is 9.70%, or $51.57, below the 52-week high of $531.49 which is also the all-time high for stock. Analyst Ratings On Wednesday, May 1, 2024, it was reported that Loop Capital Markets gave Meta a buy grade with a hold action. On Thursday, April 25, 2024, it was reported that Deutsche Bank gave Meta a buy grade with a hold action. On Thursday, April 25, 2024, it was reported that KeyBank gave Meta an overweight grade with a hold action. On Thursday, April 25, 2024, it was reported that UBS gave Meta a buy grade with a hold action. On Thursday, April 25, 2024, it was reported that Raymond James gave Meta 
a strong buy grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Meta stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. The following signals have been identified for Meta. The Meta stock holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, giving a positive forecast for the stock, but the stock has a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals, where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $471.01 and $475.72. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price, and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Wednesday, May 15, 2024, and so far it has fallen negative 0.336%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, sell signal nine days ago, Bollinger, buy signal 21 days ago, short-term moving average, buy signal three days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal three days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages buy signal 27 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, sell signal 12 days ago, the long-term moving average, buy signal 19 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, risk, and stop loss for Meta. On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $443.29 and $441.38. There is a natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Meta finds support just below today's level at $443.29. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $441.38 and $432.62. This stock has average movements during the day, and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $6.02 between high and low, or 1.27%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 2.10%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Meta, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. This is a relatively normal PE ratio, often seen in businesses with long track records or predictable revenues. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2024 is expected on July 24, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $4.67. Keep an eye on these numbers as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Meta. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Meta is at $484.10. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Meta encounters its first support level at $443.29. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Meta from multiple analyst sources is a strong buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On May 21, 2024, 
Newstead Jennifer conducted an insider sell of 905 shares of Class A common stock. On May 15, 2024, Travis Tracy Thomas conducted an insider buy of 1,541 shares of Class A common stock. On May 15, 2024, Travis Tracy Thomas conducted an insider buy of 302 shares of Class A common stock. On May 15, 2024, Travis Tracy Thomas conducted an insider sell of 1,541 shares of restricted stock units, RSU, Class A. On May 15, 2024, Houston Andrew conducted an insider buy of 1,541 shares of Class A common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of negative 24.903. Overall, insiders purchased 123,200 shares and sold 206,046 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $463.95, a decrease of 3.33%. This stock has medium daily movements, indicating medium risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found 19 days ago. Is Meta stock a good buy? Meta holds several positive signals, but we still don't find these to be enough for a buy candidate. At the current level, it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate in this position whilst awaiting further development. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture, we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a buy to a hold accumulate candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Wednesday, May 29th, we expect Meta to open down negative $1.38 and start trading at $478.54. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.